There's a lead group out here. They Ken Balcom spends now. most of his time following around the alphabetically labeled southern resident orca pods, JKNL. He has the most extensive catalog of orcas on the planet, but he doesn't really need them. He can recognize them at first sight. He confirmed the birth of the newest orca, a baby born to J-Pod last week, and he identified the mother, J-16. But now he has his doubts. Well, the mother is uh, 43 years old, roughly. She's what we would consider to be post-reproductive. Speaking to us via Skype from his home in the San Juans, Malcolm told us it's possible the older orca gave birth, or the baby may actually belong to J-16's daughter. Then he revealed something that has whale experts very excited. Close-ups of the baby reveals something very unusual. It has some very serious tooth rakes across the back and dorsal fin, as if it were an assisted birth. Well, we all know how orcas have amazing intelligence and abilities to work together while they hunt and travel. So Balcom thinks it's quite possible they could help each other during difficult times, like difficult childbirths. And uh, it was another adult whale that apparently pulled this baby from the womb, if that was the case. And we're wondering, well, who is that other adult whale? Well, the answer may be right underneath their noses. J-16 may actually be a grandmother and a midwife. We wondered, well, maybe her daughter had the baby and she helped pull it out and now our daughter needs to rest up and grandma's taking care of the baby. We won't know the answer for a while. J-Pod is currently far north of the San Juans, but headed that way. When they arrive, if Balcom sees the baby is with J-16's daughter, it will mean they have a new first-time mother and a better chance of recovering the population. Yeah, right now we're at 78, and that's a very low number for the population of the Salish Sea uh, Southern Resident Orcas. So maybe, just maybe, if this one survives after 2014, that will be the end of 2014, will mark the beginning of a, hopefully a new revival for those orcas.